Unreal. I mean, uh, obviously, uh, long summer, so I think everyone was super excited to see each other and uh, get back to work. How was the summer in terms of kind of the work put in and, and how you're feeling about your game coming back? Uh, yeah. Thing, uh, as I said, it was long, right? So like uh, lots of lots of thinking, lots of time to get better. And uh, you know, uh, as I said, as I said, like um, you know, obviously the last the last year was was uh, wasn't wasn't the year that we all wanted. So uh, so that was kind of like uh, kind of like that big big warning for us or for me, you know, for myself especially. You know, I uh, wanted to have a good year. So you know, I spent a lot of time just working on my game, working off ice on ice. And uh, you know, as I said, super excited to be back. Then you proven yourself at the National Hockey League level and you continue to take strides every year and now it, it would appear anyhow from the outside that there's a lot more competition here. I imagine you welcome that, don't you? And, and if so, how, what is your approach to this? I mean, it's, it's, the, it's the best league in the world so it's always going to be competition, right? So, you know, you can uh, you can never sleep in and, uh, you know, you always got to work hard and uh, be a great teammate and just, you know, work your uh, work uh, or try to do your best every single day and, uh, you know, learn from the other guys and push the other guys as well. What has been communicated to you in terms of how they want to manage the goaltending situation? This year? Well, I mean, it's uh, it's literally up to up to, up to them, and the only thing that I can do is stop the puck. So I'm gonna do my best to stop every single puck. Have you have you noticed the difference in mood or environment or energy here compared to when you left? Yeah, well, but at the same time, you know, my job is to stop the puck. So you know, so for me, uh, obviously, you know, my my it's uh, obviously it's uh, it's a little bit different right now. But at the same time, nothing's changing for me. You know, we're still like gotta perform the best as I can. So obviously it's nice to be back and you know the environment obviously it's it's nice right now but you know the goal is still the same. Let's talk about uh, you talk about moving forward and forgetting last year. Uh, when you look at the, this goal team and this team as a whole, does it feel as though uh, there's something to prove here? Like I know you want to forget about last year. Do you use that to fuel you to to prove something this year, does it feel that way? Not, not even proof. I, I think that you know we are all winners here, and we got a great leadership here. And you know, uh, especially after that last year, it's not that we want to prove anyone anything. We know what we can do, and we just didn't do it last year. So it might be an extra motivation for us, or you know, like the wheel that's gonna push us, push us forward. And you know, even on the hard days, you know, like I'm just gonna be remembering the the feel last year that I don't want to feel again, right? So you know, when we missed it by a couple points, so you know, that's just like uh, that's the that's the wheel, that's the fan behind us. Who's going to keep pushing us forward? Is yeah. your starts have gone up over the last couple of years. I mean, have you learned now? You can look back more broadly about it. The things you've learned about your game and just sort of, you know, that role uh, as you take it more regularly and the minutes have gone up. Is there things that you've kind of, you know, thought about and worked on now? Well, well, not really. Uh, I'm just going to be, you know, do keep doing the same stuff. If I'm playing, I'm going to do my best. If I'm not playing, I'm going to be cheering for uh, for the other guys, right? So, you know, obviously I want to play every single game, but you know, at the same time, I know who I share locker room with. So, you know, I'm just going to keep pushing and pushing, and then you know, whoever place I'm pretty sure that's gonna do do their best to you know bring and bring the bring the W's because that's all it matters right now and as I said we just don't want to be in the same situation like last year. Like like Justin Wolf is pushing as, as well. Yeah well as I said obviously Wolf great goalie you know lots of lots of great years behind him but you know at the same time it's it's gonna be in every single team you know it's always gonna be uh, somebody who's gonna be pushing and then you know the only thing what you can do is just try your best right so that's what I'm gonna do. What's what what is your relationship like with Dustin you know, the goalie room right now? Yeah, great. Like I mean, as I said, we are one big family here. You can you can see it everywhere. Consistency, yeah. commitment, compete. You know, like we have all those signs here. We are just a bunch of bunch of friends here. You know, and uh, but at, at the same time, everybody wants to play, right? But I'm pretty sure the mentality is for so uh, is is the same for every single guy. If you're playing, you're doing your best. If you're not playing, you're cheering for the other guy. So. Dan, when it comes to your game, anything different this off season that you tried to tweak or change or well, even something new? No, well, the only thing was that I had way more time, right? So uh, you know, obviously that summer was was long, and but at the same time, you know, the, uh, Ricky and the strength staff and uh, all the trainers they did a great job. You know, I was communicating with them because it was first time for me when I had you know those was what four months ish. So you know, they I think they did a great job, and you know, it, the testing went well for everybody. I'm pretty sure. So you know, it was just different summer, lots of thinking and uh, lots of watching. On TV and biting my nails, and uh, you know, thinking why why we are not there.